Good morning, it's your crazy old coot here. How you doing? Okay, today I wanted to show you some of the uh, Gigabyte Gaming 3 AB350 board that we uh, just got and got running. And okay, so here's just a picture of it as we're bench checking. And here's another one. Nice picture of that Noctia cooler, huh? And if you notice, the uh, video card is my old... HD 7850. We just wanted to throw something in here and make sure we got video out. And there's a better picture of it. Last we have, uh, here it is booting up. So we know it's working and we're going to throw it into the case and we're going to start benchmarking. Okay, so this is what we do for, I'm testing for stability. The first thing I do is I run a Cinebench tech. That way I can monitor everything real time here. And um, so far, so good. Pushing 123 amps, but yeah, not too, too bad for this board. This would be pushing it on uh, an ASRock AB350M Pro 4 board, but for this board, it's fine. And 103 watts, which is considering the, the Spire is a uh, 95 watt TDP, it's... Uh, Really good. So we got it 2008, but and uh, again we're running 1.34 volts, and uh, not too bad. It looks good. Uh, we're running Relive, and we're also running um, the HD monitor. So now we're going to do spy test. Yeah, time spy test, and. Uh, so, time for the elevator music. Oh, we're back! Remember, this is just stability testing because we're running Relive, which is uh, recording this, and then we're also running Hardware Monitor. Okay, but again, these look pretty good and stable. I'll also run like 
next I'll run Fire Strike, and then I'll run uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider. And if all these work, there's 95% chance that everything is good. So here is a hot run of Cinebench. So this is at 3.9 gigahertz with uh, the memory at uh, 3,066, and it ran at you know 1,310, which is a pretty darn good score. And uh, single core, actually it's single thread at 160, which is not bad for an R5 1600 at 3.9 gigahertz. And then I run Heaven. Now, Heaven is just a, it's a graphics thing. It doesn't really hit the CPU hard. It's more of a your graphics card. And we did some pretty good score here for an RX 480, averaging 80 frames per second. And that's what it basically averaged. You know, the dips were few and far between. And here's the Time Spy score at 3.9 gigahertz. So she really... Uh, did good here and then uh, we got the fire strike score and you get your you know your physics test and and all that so so basically these are tests and uh, are your uh, benchmark tests and then I do the the uh, rise of the tomb raider for a game test and this is how I got it set up and uh, so we're doing pretty good in, you know, 89.3 frames per second. Not bad, you know. And uh, so a lot of these things I'm doing because 